there, this is Angela from We Are Family Homeschoolers, and I wanted to bring a review to you today of General Science 1, Survey of Earth and Sky, Studying the Ocean, Astronomy, Weather, and Minerals. This is put out by Masterbooks. It is a Christian curriculum. It's for grades 7 through 12. And in this teacher guide are also your student worksheets and your quizzes and your tests. And let's go ahead and take a look at this. Okay, when you first get into the guide here, you have this nice schedule laid out. This tells the student each day which book they're going to work in, how many pages they're going to read, and when they're going to do their worksheets, when they're going to do their quizzes. You can go ahead and write the due date down, but I just have my children write the date that they did it. You can also keep grades there if you want to. So this schedule is really handy to keep your kids on track and you can get an idea of what they're getting done. Um, the first book that's covered here is Weather, Meteorology Worksheets to Use with the New Weather Book. And you can do these books in any order you choose, it doesn't matter. So this is what the worksheet looks like. There's words to know, finding definitions, there's short answers, And the next lesson, words to know, short answer, fill in the blank, true and false. And then there's usually an activity, which can be a research project, or a poster, or some sort of science experiment. So there's lots of options, and that's what the worksheets look like. In the back of the book, you have the quizzes and the tests and the teacher answer key just right here um, a lot of parents will go ahead and rip out the answer key and put it in a binder so um, that they can have that separate from the student workbook there's also a glossary in the back of the book so if your student needs help finding the words so this is very user-friendly. Masterbooks creates all their curriculum specifically for homeschoolers to be concise and clear and easy to use. So let's take a look at the first book, The Weather. These are gorgeous books, high quality. You'll see in the front of the books there are three colors of reading levels level 1, level 2, and level 3. So you can use this with multiple children in different grades. And the younger children, you would read the level 1. Middle schoolers would do up level 1 and level 2. And high schoolers would do all three colors. So if you, had, if you were doing this with the whole family, you'd read the white section to all the kids. Let your middle schooler go further and then your high schooler is going to move on to the gray, so they're going to do everything. So there's gorgeous pictures here. The teacher's guide will tell you exactly how many pages to read a day. Very beautiful. Glossy pages. And the back of this book is a nice fold-out poster here. There we go. Let's just turn the camera so you can see the different types of weather systems. Very neat. Okay, let's show you the next book. The ocean. Same system with the three levels of reading. Levels one, two, and three. Beautiful full color pictures. Lots of information here. Everything is from a Christian point of view. Everything points back to creation. Very beautiful. In the back of this book, I believe there's also a poster. There we go. So these are the levels of the ocean. for reference. Ok, 
Okay, moving on to the next book, Astronomy. Okay, here's your level one reading is white, level two is light purple, level three is a, like a navy color almost. So each level student's getting just the right amount of information. Not too much, not overwhelming. Beautiful pictures. And there's another poster in the back here. This one's the solar system. So I guess you could pull these out and hang these up in your schoolroom wall. I'm probably going to leave them in the book for now. I have to talk to my husband about that. He's the decorator in the family. And the last one, this book of minerals. As you can see the table of contents, how to use this book. Three different levels of reading, elementary, middle school, high school. Gorgeous pictures again. I have uh, children already looking into this book just for the pictures. So that's exciting. That means this one will be easy to teach. Because they want to know what everything is. Everything is treasure in here. Lots of good information. Also a poster in the back. And this is mineral pigments around the world. Where different cultures and different countries get their colors, what they use them for. Very interesting. All right, so I'm going to be using this program for my seventh grade daughter, and I'm going to hang on to those high school credits for her, so whenever she finishes this program, she'll get that credit. And I'm also going to use this for my tenth grade son. They're, they each have their own teacher's guide, student workbook to work through, and um, they'll be using They'll be alternating the books so that they don't have to use them at the same time. Okay, I hope this um, curriculum review was helpful for you, and um, please like and subscribe. Thank you.